Well, good morning, South Florida. I'm Alexis Frazier. Here's a look at your top stories today. Police are searching for a gunman who opened fire on a store clerk in Miami's El Portal neighborhood. It happened after a scuffle at Jenison's liquor store along North Miami Avenue. And police say the suspect tried to return a purchase and the store clerk said it was not possible. So that reportedly led to the suspect grabbing a full bottle from inside that store and making a run for it. When the store clerk tried to stop the suspect, police say he was shot in the stomach. We're told that clerk is now in critical condition. South Florida rapper Kodak Black had nothing to say to our local 10 cameras as he bonded out of jail last night. The 26 year old whose real name is Bill Capri has a long rap sheet. This time he was arrested after police say they found the rapper behind the wheel of a Bentley sound asleep in plantation. Police searched the car and say they found 4.1 grams of cocaine in a baggie. Capri was charged with drug possession, tampering with physical evidence and improperly stopping standing or parking. Do you have any comment about the arrest of Mr. Lomeli? Uh, are you his family? It, 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 no comment from people at the home of Miami-Dade police officer who found himself on the other side of the law. Officer Miguel Lomeli was charged with armed sexual battery, kidnapping, and armed burglary. Police say he argued with his ex-girlfriend before dragging her into her, her own home and raping her. We're told the victim is also a police officer. Lomeli is being held behind bars without bond. We're seeing new video of a chaotic crash that injured three people, including a Miami Gardens police officer. A red light camera caught who police say is 36 year old James Lewis blowing through a stoplight before slamming into a police cruiser. The officer was able to radio for help while, tra while trapped in his car in the area of Northwest 27th Avenue and 167th Street. Police say Lewis is was actually under the influence. He is facing a slew of charges. Thankfully, though, everyone involved is expected to be OK. Well, as breaking news happens, we have you covered on air and online. Just head over to local10.com for more local news coverage and updates.